Hello friends, this is a case of laparoscopic ovarian cystectomy and here we will show you how to do the ovarian cystectomy by wrapping technique. This technique is very famous all over world and gynecologists they use it to stabilize the cystic wall while they are separating the cyst from the ovarian cortex. So, we can see this is a left sided ovarian cyst but it has little torsion and it is reaching to the right side. So, first we will do the aspiration and then detorsion will be performed. So, this is a simple cyst, but it is little large approximately 7 centimeter of the cyst. So, first step is that we will do aspiration. So, this is aspiration needle which is doing the aspiration of the ovarian cyst. This was a simple ovarian cyst which was confirmed by the MRI. So, we are not using any endo bag if it would have been dermoid or any endometrioma then we will do it after putting inside the endo bag. So, we can see cyst is deflating. and the suction is attached with the aspiration needle and all the fluid of the ovarian cyst is sucked out. After that we will hold the anti major ovarian the detorsion is done and the anti major ovarian border of the cyst and with the harmonic just a small incision will be given over the ovarian cortex a little bit tearing will be performed. So, that the cystic wall will be separately visible. Now, left hand has a grasper and right hand has a Maryland and this is the inner cystic wall which is stripping from the outer ovarian cortex. So, this is a thin cyst not thick like endometrioma. So, you have to go to a good uh, plane and then it should start holding by the grasper and then you can keep on separating all around equally. Now, once approximately 2 3 centimeter is stripped after that to prevent the you know slipping of the cyst you can wrap it over the grasper and once you wrap it will optimize the traction and as well as it will give you the better hold and it will not slip. So, this technique is very good to prevent the slipping of the cystic wall and to get the entire cyst separated from the ovarian cortex. Although you have to separate all around equally, but slow wrapping will help you on the left hand instrument and then you can separate the entire cyst with a good plane of dissection. Again wrap and again separate the ovarian cortex. Ipsilateral port is required for this technique and separation is continued. No further wrapping and separating the cortex. So, it is done. Now, this is just last part again you can push it about around the Cooper ligament and again you can wrap it. So, it is done now you can disengage it and then just the suction irrigation will be carried out <coughs> and any oozing or any bleeding should be taken care of and you should inspect all around the pelvis for any bleeding is not there and after that little suction irrigation again will be performed and the cystic valve will be taken out just shaking 
and you can see this is clear fluid there is no bleeding two three time irrigation will be performed to check if there is a bleeding you can take a bite you can suture or you can use bipolar to do fulg or desiccation or monopolar to fulgration but and now this is the cystic wall this is 5 mm telescope and with the 10 mm umbilical port cyst is taken out so thank you very much for watching this video